Rise on the fire, keep it your chest. He's a schoolboy football. A team could rise and a team could fall. But they never will know until the whistle blows around. Come enjoy the show. He's a school. Well, let's start then with a look at the Dintil technical lineup. And they are playing a 4 4 2 with the experienced goalkeeper Asher Hutchinson. The back four Jordan Redison, Raheem Harris, Richard Hewitt, and Malik White with Gabriel Anderson, a late replacement for Tayamba Chin, Raphael Smith, Shamir Hutchinson, and Zidan Clark in the middle. Tyrese Gow and Giovanni Affleck are the two up front. They have scored 33 goals this season between them. They are coached by Anil Thomas. Yeah, Tyrese Gow has been one of the danger men in schoolboy football this season. He'll be looking to make his mark in this big game. Kingston College. There is their lineup. Malik Williams will be in goal. Robert Sow, O'Neill Bryan. Rajay Zimenez and Kimani Reese at the back. Dejon Green, the Wilmers transfer. Jaheem McLean and Alex Hislop in the middle with Damien Smith and Demaria Daly. The only man to get into double figures in terms of goal score this season with 14 for Kingston College up front. They are coached by Vassa Reynolds. No stranger to winning this title. No stranger to winning knockout title. They beat Dintel Technical by three goals to two at the National Stadium in Kingston, Jamaica. Kester Anderson, as soon as he sent the game on its way, we had the opening goal. Only 30 seconds in. Brilliant work here by Giovanni Affleck, getting a deflection and the ball falling to Tyrese Gow, who absolutely buried it with a ferocious right-footed effort. Here he is, 21st goal of the season and opening Dintel Technicals Champions Cup campaign, 1-0. Malik Williams had no chance. Kingston College took some time to get into the game. Damien Smith with a left-footed drive just over the top. Casey would get the equalizer. A penalty. The shot coming from Demaria Daly. Richard Ewart with the handed ball and Robert Sell stepping up to level for Kingston College it was 1-1 then in the 44th minute second KC goal coming and this was a good one his luck with the pass the cross from Smith and the finish from Jaheim McLean lovely header great build up this is neat football from Kingston College Asher Hutchinson diving as if it was FIFA but to no avail 2-1 then they made it 3-1, still in the first half. Asha Hutchinson left with no choice. Absolutely no choice but to take down Deshaun Byfield. Got a yellow card for it. Showed some speed there, Byfield. And Saul stepped up again this time, went to the right of goalkeeper Hutchinson. He gets the wrong way but couldn't get there in time. And the Kingston College went up by three goals to one. That's how they went to the halftime break. In the second half, that was another lovely cross coming from Damien Smith and a terrific save. This one from Jaheim McLean should have been put home. Dintel Technical, they found life. This is Holloway for Asha Hutchinson who does brilliantly to escape three defenders picked out the outstanding Giovanni Affleck that is a terrific finish from Affleck as well fabulous technique Manic White was ecstatic on the sidelines but ultimately that's all she wrote and Kingston College would hold on for the 3-2 victory. Kingston College, 12 shots, 6 on target. Dintil, 7, 3 on target. 18 falls in the contest, 10 against KC. Yellow cards, all three going to Dintil technical players. Kingston College with 57% of possession to 43 for Dintil technical. The Kingston College captain is the player of the match.
And here we have our man of the match, Robert Sio. He will be presented with this award by Kadeen Webley, the junior brand manager for Digicel. Robert, we had a talk at the Champions Cup draw and you said, I'm ready, ready to take it all. You took the two penalties today. Are you the designated penalty kicker? Um, yes, um, we've been practice, practicing penalties um, throughout the week. And I've been finishing in the training session, so coach give me a, a, a head on to take the penalties. Well, you are the captain for this KC team. You guys now have more work to do, more jobs ahead, both in Manning Cup and the Champions Cup. Do you think that your boys are ready for it? Yes, we've been um, preparing throughout the um, summer, a lot of sacrifices. So we've been putting in the hard work, so I think we're ready, ready mentally and physically. Okay, well, thank you. Uh, thanks. And now. Schoolboy football, come, come, look one, look all. Which team are the best and are better than the rest of the fire team beat your chest? Is a schoolboy football, a team could rise and a team could fall. But they never will know until the whistle blows around, come enjoy the show.